welcome to an evening you may not remember, but you won't forget. How you doing? Hey. I know you're you look, you look fabulous. All right, we're going to uh, start off slow and taper off. I think it's the best plan we got with this crowd. Everything good. Alicia, do you know what this is, by any chance? You want to share it with the rest of the class? It's a pocket knife. A pocket knife, that's right. Actually, it's, uh, it is a pocket knife because it fits right well, uh, well in the pocket, but it's also uh, known as a pen knife. You ever heard it called a pen knife? And you know why they call it a pen knife? Thanks for asking. I'm, I'm, I knew you were, that was the next thing up. Back in the old days, they used to use feathers to write with quills, you know? Now, you can't very well pluck a feather out of a turkey and start to write with it. You have to put a point on it. How in the world do you put a point on the end of a feather? A, a pen knife. You all seem pretty underwhelmed at the educational portion. Of that. <laughs> We're going to move on to the entertainment portion and see if that gets any better. All right. This is actually called the... Uh, how'd that work out? Anything working on it? Day five. We got to ten. All right. The eagle flies now. All right. All right. Beautiful. All right. Time for about five more cocktails. Woohoo! All right, kid. I'm going to pick you up. Did you need something there, Robert? I'm good. You sure? The more you drink, the better this looks. Trust me, I see the boat. Yeah, yeah. I actually suggest you start drinking now. Where are you going? This is actually called the disappearing pen knife trick. The disappearing pen knife trick. What's the name of this trick again? Disappearing pen knife trick. Thank you very much. All right. Okay. That's good. What is your name? I'm Eric. Eric, I'm going to ask you that again in a minute. Eric, I want you to charge out with the answer. No hesitation. You get the idea? All right. All right. Another Eric. Alicia, if I was to take this knife, drop it over here in my hand, and I was to make it disappear, and then reappear over here in my pocket, most people would say it's a trick. Sleight of hand. Never went in my hand, went right in my pocket. And that's exactly what happened, honestly. But, if I was to leave the knife here in my hand, and I was to make it disappear now, it should be a much better trick, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Especially since you're staring at the end of it. I can't do that. That'd be real magic. I'm not that good. I try, but I'm not that good. All right, now stay with me. And now, if I were to leave the knife here in my hand, I got too many cords over here, and I were to reach in here and uh, wave my hand surreptitiously over like so, and suddenly a white knife appears. At this point, most people would say, gee whiz, I'll bet he's got two knives. Two knives is the answer, Carol. The white knife lives here. The brown knife actually lives over here. You following this? Over here. Now let me ask you something, Mia. If I have a brown knife here, what do I have left here? Probably a white knife. <laughs> What's the name of this trick again? This knife. Ha, 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 ha.